Yo, what's going on guys, your boy Tag935 are back again with another video. And this time it is how to duplicate your insured weapon and turn them into a contraband weapon for you to then fill your contraband stash. And there is absolutely zero cooldown on your insured slot. So this is super OP. It's really easy to do. It's going to be a super quick video. So yeah, without any further ado, let's get into it. So yeah, like I said, this is super easy to do, okay? Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to go to your gear and load out, and we're going to want to put our insured weapons into these slots in a specific order, all right? Um, the weapon that is going to be duplicated needs to go into slot two, okay? Uh, slot one must also have an insured weapon in it. However, this won't duplicate. This will stay as an insured weapon. But the one that you place into the second slot will become duplicated by doing this, all right? And all you simply want to do is go into the game, play the game exactly as you wish, uh, do contracts, do whatever it is you need to do. However, when you come to finish your game, you can either dashboard or you can actually exfil normally. It doesn't really matter, but if you've got a tombstone, you're going to want to obviously dashboard. Um, but when you load into your next game, what you'll see is that obviously that first weapon slot is going to have that insured weapon number one. However, your second slot is now going to have a contraband version of that insured weapon in it. Go ahead, unequip it. This will go back into your contraband stash items. And then you can, as you can see, reapply the insured weapon slot too because it doesn't have a cooldown so you can literally rinse and repeat all of the guns that you wish to duplicate in order to do camo challenges or whatever so yeah super op i hope this has been helpful if it has go ahead smash a like comment subscribe if you're new and i will catch you on the next one peace